it's a great pleasure for me to welcome a friend uh, to USC. I've been sort of on him for like six or seven years, and he's been so busy he hasn't been able to get here. Um, but I'm not just a friend, I'm a fan. And it didn't actually start that way. I've, I've never told Ben this story, but um, I didn't like Ben much at first. <laughs> but it had nothing to do with him. He didn't even know this at the time. I was a first year lawyer at uh, this law firm. And I wound up working for someone that was senior to me, uh, a young tax lawyer. And she just happened to be brilliant and attractive, which are you know, not two combinations that you find at most law firms. Brilliant, you find. But she was this attractive young associate. And then, at, in fact, I wasn't the only one that didn't like Ben. Every guy in our firm didn't like Ben because we found out immediately that she was dating this guy that happened to be at another firm, smart guy, Harvard Law School, sort of all this stuff. And so you're not going to like that guy right away, right? So a couple of weeks later, I actually meet him. We're in sort of the same line, real estate, land use, politics. And we sort of meet him. And begrudgingly, I found out that the people were sort of right. He is sort of a good guy. So we've been friends for, God, I don't even want to say for how long, because it's gone by quickly. Oh, and uh, <laughs> you'll play basketball together. He's more the uh, bruise and foul type and the <laughs> finesse type, if you know his game. Um, but I'm glad to welcome him here. And it was, it was apparent to me, even early on, that uh, Ben was a star. And everything that he's been associated with, with some bumps along the way, of course, he's really shined. And it's really fun to watch somebody when you know they have all the tools to watch him take off and do his thing. So I'll, I'm going to let you sort of learn from him directly instead of me reading his bio. But you know, uh, great schools, lawyer, started a business, then transitioned into Guthy Rinker. We're going to talk about that. From that, he rose through the ranks till he's uh, been the CEO for probably five or six years, one of the four principal owners of the company. And under his leadership, this thing has just become a juggernaut. Here to talk to uh, us about the story of Guthy Rinker and his path, please welcome Ben Vandebutt. Ben, hey, thank you. Come, come up. Oh, here we go. 